this new season of Doctor Who should be watched <laughs> because um, it's the most exciting yet. Where is the Doctor? We have Stephen Moffat taking his mad inventive brain in every direction. Doctor? Doctor! And it's wonderful, I just think it's wonderful that we've got two episodes set in the US. You know, I think it's great for the ambition of the show. I wear Stetson now. Stetson's a cool. <laughs> Monument Valley is so iconic. People will go, oh, John Wayne, the, you know, the classic, wonderful tombstone rock formations. It's, it's just, it's America. It, it spells America. This is an amazing film. It's on such an epic scale, which, you know, I don't think Doctor Who's done before. I think we have the best monsters since Sleeping Angels. Mysterious monsters in Doctor Who so far. You see these eyes. They're all eyes. And one thing I can tell you. Monsters are real. And the Doctor is having to face a very great and present and dangerous evil. And without giving too much away, he's got a huge battle on his hand. We've been recruited. Recruited by who? You're going to have to trust us this time. You have to do this. I think I'm not why. I love the fact that Amy has this massive secret from him. So the Doctor's relationship to Amy is going to change forever. My life in your hands. Amelia Pond. And it's just got everything in it. It can go anywhere in time and space. So the possibilities are endless. I think the Doctor is going to face his darkest days. I've been running faster than I've ever run. And it's time for me to stop. And I've always wanted to explore the dark, the dark bit of the Doctor. And take him to that place and get him placed in that situation where he has choices that are so drastic that it tears him apart. The stakes really are higher than ever. Mm -hmm.